हेलो एवरीवन वी स्टार्ट विद अवर न्यू टॉपिक इन ऑब्जेक्ट ओरिएंटेड प्रोग्रामिंग अवर न्यू टॉपिक इज कंस्ट्रक्टर नाउ व्हाट इज कंस्ट्रक्टर इन ऑब्जेक्ट ओरिएंटेड प्रोग्रामिंग इट इज अ स्पेशल टाइप ऑफ मेथड व्हिच इज एग्जीक्यूटेड ऑटोमेटिकली whenever a object is created whenever you are creating the object sap automatically call a method which is called as constructor it is called as constructor means we are not explicitly calling the method constructor whenever we are creating the object sap automatically call a method which is called as constructor means will not go for pattern button and we will not call the constructor method whenever you will create the object sap automatically call the constructor method suppose we are creating the object by this statement create object object name so whenever this statement will execute sap automatically call a method that is your constructor method now in sap we have two types of constructor first one is constructor and the second one is class underscore constructor we'll cover each and every point so i will go to sc24 transaction code it is the transaction code for global classes suppose i will pass some existing class name in this class we already have a method display now you can see we have two methods available one is constructor and one is class underscore constructor i'm clicking on to this and you can see we have one method with the name constructor now i am clicking on another class constructor and you can see we have another method name class underscore constructor so we have two types of constructor constructor and class underscore constructor now if you see this constructor has which level which type of method it is a instance method and class underscore constructor is using which type of method static method so many time we call this constructor as instance constructor we will call this constructor as static constructor i'll just read some points but we covered we have two types of constructor constructor and class underscore constructor this constructor is called as instance constructor this constructor is called as static constructor this instance constructor what is the method name what is the method name what is the method name constructor for this particular constructor what is the method name class underscore constructor now these are the two types of constructor instance constructor and static constructor or you can simply call it as constructor or and class underscore constructor now i will cover this second i will cover this third point constructors are the methods with a predefined name 
have you seen these methods these constructor and class underscore constructor these are predefined names so we cannot give our own name these are predefined names we cannot change this name now multiple instance and static constructor are not allowed in a class suppose if i want to take one more instance constructor sap will automatically give me the error that you can only only take one instance or static constructor you can only only take one instance and one static constructor in a class now i will come on to next important point your instance constructor has only importing parameters suppose i am clicking on my instance constructor or constructor if i am going for parameters you can see if i am declaring some parameter here i cannot give the type it is importing exporting returning or changing suppose simple rather than going for constructor method i am going for suppose display method which was created previously and i am clicking on parameters button you can see here we can give the type of the parameter it is importing exporting returning changing whatever the type we want to give but whenever you are going for instance constructor or constructor method if i click on parameters there is no option to give importing exporting returning and changing it means whatever the parameters you will give here all are you are by default importing parameters now if i will show you the next point your instance constructor has only the provision of importing parameters one of the most important point now your static constructor does not have any parameters suppose if i will click on my static constructor or class underscore constructor and i will click on parameter tab you can see i am clearly getting the message that your class constructor do not have any parameters so in instance constructor you have a provision for giving only the importing parameters in class underscore constructor you cannot give any any parameter now your instance constructor can access both the static and instance attributes suppose i am going for attributes tab i am declaring one attribute suppose p val 1 it is my instance attribute suppose visibility is public suppose i am writing character 1 suppose i am declaring one more attribute and it is my static attribute suppose and i am saying visibility is public it is character one now i will go to method tab your instance constructor can access both the instance and static attribute suppose i am going for this method and i am writing suppose write lv underscore val one write lv underscore val two. This is my instance attribute. This is my static attribute. If I am checking the syntax, 
I'll just check the name again. P val one. The method, the parameter name is the attribute name is P val one. Sorry. Write P val one. Write P val two. I'm checking the syntax, and you can see. my instance constructor can access both the attributes both the attributes now suppose if i am writing both the attributes in static constructor if i am writing if i will check the syntax now i am getting the error because your static constructor can only only access the static attributes it cannot access the instance attribute so what is the third difference we mentioned your instance constructor can access both type of attributes but your static constructor can only only access the static attributes rest point of this topic will continue in the next video thank you